Hi YouTube, the Dakota here. Okay, so welcome to this tutorial. Uh, basically, one of the problems I've had today is um, while I was setting up a new desktop computer, uh, I accidentally set the resolution too high, and uh, when I plugged it into my uh, TV screen, uh, I couldn't get any signal through the PC. So basically, the screen, the resolution was overloading the TV. Uh, it was set too high for the TV, so. Uh, I was in a bit of a pickle. No matter how many times I rebooted the computer, I couldn't get it back on. Um, I um, plugged it into another monitor, tried to reset it, um, and it just reset back to the high resolution when it got plugged back into this TV. Uh, so, that was a problem. So, I'm going to show you how you can redo it, um, reset it, uh, without the need for a PC screen. So what we're going to do is, we're going to do a hard reset on the computer. So we'll just hold the power button down for five seconds. And this is the same on a laptop or a PC. So the computer's off. And we'll switch it back on. And as you can see, the screen works. The screen's coming on. But when it gets to the uh, main screen, uh, the main desktop, it'll go back off. So as you can see, we've got the Windows logo. It's all loading up. and then it just goes off so the computer is actually at the welcome screen now um, so what we want to do to fix this is as long as you can see your pa as long as you know your password and you can type without type your password without looking um, what you want to do to get it off the welcome screen just press the enter key uh, I'm not going to show you my password uh, so I'm just going to type in my pin uh, it's actually only a four digit pin and we press enter okay so you may be able to hear um, the computer's working now it's logging in so we're going to give it five to ten seconds just to log in as you can see it's likely just loaded the desktop and generally the desktop will load with the mouse in the middle of the screen um, which is always good news because it means we can work and know where, exactly where the mouse is um, we know we're not going to click on any icons. Okay. So now what you want to do is you want to get your mouse. And as you can see, we've still got no signal. So what you want to do is get your mouse and just right click. And we'll give that a couple of seconds. And then on your keyboard, you want to press up the up button twice. So one to and that will give that will take the context menu to the graphics options press enter uh, I'm not sure if you can hear that but it should be loading again okay so we'll give it a second for the graphics options to load up and the computer stopped working so it sounds like it's done uh, then what you want to do is press the tab button five times one two three four five press enter as you can see it's working again so we give that a, give that a few more seconds again Okay, that should be loaded. Um, and then what you want to do again, press tab four times. One, two, three, four. Press the space bar. Okay, and then what you want to do, this what this what what that will do when you press the space bar is select the drop down menu for the resolution. So now what you want to do is press just keep pressing the down button press it as many times as you want um, always press it over ten times um, just in case and then click enter okay and then press the tab button once more 
press enter and that should bring your screen back on there we go okay so and then what you need to do quickly uh, within 15 seconds press keep changes so you press keep changes as you can see set the resolution to 800 by 600 if we just look there and then all you need to do then is just select the correct res select the correct resolution 1360 by 768 keep changes and there you go your screen's back on so that's how you change your screen resolution um, or reset your screen resolution without the need for a screen alright guys thanks for watching I hope this video helped um, as always hit that sub subscribe button um, give me a thumbs up if you like this and be sure to drop me a comment um, on any computer problems you might have and I'll do my best to help alright thanks for watching see you all again soon bye for now